Hi, we're Hollywood actors, and you might remember us from our popular 90s fat suit franchise, Chuck and Buck. We're not gonna make any money if you keep eating all the flour. Well then stop buying such tasty flour. We just wanna sincerely apologize for making those films. Chuck, stop trying to look at my penis. Well, I dang all can't see mine. Now, when we filmed movies like Come Fat, or the horror film Fat Scream, ah! we're gonna eat you! We could've never predicted the body positivity movement would get so big. No pun intended, and it won't be complete until we address our participation in the problem by creating films like Honey, I Ate My Dog. Well, maybe they should stop making such tasty dogs. So thank you for holding us accountable for making the movie Mission Fat Possible. The only way we can get out of here is if you eat this carrot. You know I don't do that anymore. I stopped eating carrots a long time ago. I got my lard now. God damn it, Chuck. Our film Fat Gaze has not aged well. I'm going on top. I'm going on top. I'm going on top. I'm going on top. Oh, brother. I'd also like to say that when we were filming the movie Too Fat, Too Furious, I did have a sex addiction. Chuck, we can't fit in that car. But Buck, it's a panel van. The fat suit fame got to my head, and I was not in the right state of mind when he asked us to make our French art film, Le Fat. It is my baguette. It is my baguette. No, it is my baguette. Hey, don't blame this on me. That was your script. Plus, Fat Rockstars was completely your idea. It's better to die young for me. me than it is to fade away. We just wanted to be like all the other great fat suit actors. Eddie Murphy, Tyler Perry, Gwyneth Paltrow. You know, in this world, I've been able to chop through almost everything, except for my own hunger. We are now begging for forgiveness from the fat community and casting directors in Hollywood for our hit film, A Fat Werewolf in Michigan. I think it's a full moon. No, Buck, this is a full moon. <laughs> Oh, brother. The body positivity movement in Hollywood has grown to epic proportions, no, no pun, pun intended. intended. Even though it was almost 20 years ago, we will be taking some time off to grow. No pun intended. And we really hope that you will let us work again in the future. How long do you think we have to take off? Probably a couple months. And after our soul searching, I promise you, you will never see another film from us about two brothers teaming up to win a hot dog eating competition. Chuck, I'm not doing the hot dog eating competition. You have a gift, Buck. We're the only two people that can shove 90 down the gullet. And you're about to throw that all away? How tasty are the dogs? We're completely different people now, and we feel terrible for making so much money off of movies like Big Problem. The boss wants you to bring him the stool samples and the bugs. Wait a second, those were stool samples and bugs? Oh, brother. And we want to make sure that no actors ever make a movie like this ever again. Well, partner, I reckon I just ate my horse. Like other actors, it may seem convenient that our opinions change at the exact same time popular opinion changed. But that's just a coincidence. And to any casting directors out there watching, we are begging for your forgiveness from the bottom of our hearts. Please don't kick us out of Hollywood. We're gonna have to replace the toilet seat again. There's porcelain everywhere. Chuck, are you sitting down while you pee again? It seemed fine at the time, though.